see the guys look just like that. So here he is out of the blue corner, the number one heavyweight contender fighting for the title here tonight. Daniel Cormier has eight championship belts at home. Do you remember, though, the nerves for your first UFC title? It's the most overwhelming thing you've ever felt in your entire life. You are sitting in the back waiting for that moment where you get an opportunity to go chase something greater than yourself. So many people have played a part in getting this man to the spot. How does he deliver? How does he not let anyone down? How does he ultimately become the champion of the world? This is a big spot for him. He is so excited to try to become the man. While self-belief is a powerful thing, he has long thought that he is the best heavyweight in the world. Tonight, he gets a chance to prove it. Just when you thought you had seen it all in the octagon, we are graced with the presence of one Cassius Clay, Muhammad Ali, taking his act to mixed martial arts. I mean, he's so pretty, John. Now he always says, I'm so pretty. He looked pretty inside the boxing ring. He intends to do the same thing inside the octagon tonight. This guy is such a great athlete. He talks what he's going to do, but he also delivers. Olympic gold medalist, boxing heavyweight, light heavyweight world champion. He has done it all. A true icon in combat sport who makes his UFC debut tonight. And to the surprise of some, he told us in the fighter meeting he's got an appetite for the wrestling stuff. So we'll see if Ali can mix it up a little bit tonight. Happy to have him here in the UFC. The greatest of all time, Muhammad Ali, ready to make a statement here tonight. Tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. All right, now for the official introductions. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, Dan the Beast Savage. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending USC heavyweight champion of the world. Muhammad Ali! The veteran Herbert Dean, our referee for this one. You ready? All right, so here we go with this stand-up only encounter. We'll see if these guys can play by the rules. Not many rules, but you can't grapple at all. No wrestling of any kind. You also are not permitted to do follow-up strikes on the floor. We are underway. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. Both fighters throwing heat now. Oh, and so now he lands another combination, so it's never just one shot. There's always two or three coming behind. A lot of times, people throw singular strikes. Not this gentleman. This man is stringing four, five, six in a row. What a great job. Oh, heavy kick to the body. So more output at least in the early going. Barely missed on an uppercut right here on the inside. Beautiful one-two punch. Straight right hand, no good. Oh, they're trying to keep shots here. We'll see who's the last man standing. Three minutes now to go in this one. 
beautiful body kicks. Going to the body now with that hook. Well placed there by Sarah. Try to establish that jab. Nice block. Another nice combination, just absolutely picking him apart on the feet. I'd probably tap and do the stretch. I mean, he is destroying him, but don't sell yourself short. You don't tap the stripes. Huge strike lands there, and somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Oh, big left. Severn's now dealing with a cheat cut. And do a work with the jab. When he gets close, he throws, he lands. Oh, nice check on the leg kick off right there. Two oh, shots being landed on both sides. Straight ahead. All right, so there's the end of the round. You see the blood trickling down as he makes his way back to the stool. Cut on the bridge of the nose, or so it appears from the strike in that round. Cut man getting right to work. All right, so there's the horn. Signifying the end of the round. We had a knockdown there, but not a knockout. No, it wasn't a knockout, but you can't take those shots. That big punch landed, and it sat him down. If he gets hit with another one of those, it might be good night, Irene. Ready, fight. Ready. Round two is on the way. Huge shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Oh, oh, right oh, oh. Oh. With one of the greatest knockouts you will see. Holy smokes. The official decision is in. We said it inside the octagon. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 26 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Muhammad All right, so a big result for a big man tonight as his star continues to shine. Congratulations to the still UFC heavyweight champion of the world. The baddest man on the planet is standing in the middle of that octagon right now. Over and over, you see him get new belts. The UFC heavyweight champion remains the same.